Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Fishing with Luke. And as you guys have probably seen, the channel name has changed, the banner icons, the profile pictures, everything will all be changing in the very, very near future. ODL Outdoor Adventures is no longer the channel name, it is now Fishing with Luke. That's what this channel is going to be called from now on. And you guys are probably like, why aren't you out fishing, Luke? Well, that is because Perth is due to have a massive storm rollover pretty soon. I'm talking 60k winds, you guys might be able to hear it right now. Massive swell, lightning, thunder, all that stuff. And that is not ideal for a person like me who, who tends to go beach fishing. Fishing off the beach, I really don't want those massive waves coming in, possibly wrecking any of my gear, getting me wet while it's freezing cold outside. So it's obviously just not ideal. So you guys can see we're back on the bed, my fl the floor of my bedroom. And that normally means we've got a review coming. Today's review, today's product review, should I say, is, you can probably tell by the thumbnail and title, but it's going to be the Dometic Esky. Now, I've got the 22 litre version right here. As you can tell, it says it on there. Dometic Cool Ice 22, that is the size. And Dometic are known for their camping fridges, their camping freezers, and obviously their ice boxes. Now, I am personally not sponsored by Dometic, so I'm not getting paid to say anything good about this. So I'm gonna give you my honest opinion. I'm gonna tell you the pros, the cons, whether or not I think this is worth the money that I spent on this, whether or not it might suit you as a fisherman, as a beach fisher, a river fisher, or maybe even a boat fisherman, whether this is going to suit your needs and what you want to use this thing for. Um, now, I obviously spent my own money on this. Uh, I got this from BCF for about $62. Um, and let's just get straight into the review, I guess. So here we've got it. As I've already said, the Megic. Cool Eyes 22, nice sticker there on the front with another Domegic brand sticker on the top. Now this is made of a hard plastic outshell, as you can tell. This is good for putting it on the rocks or something so that it doesn't like get punctured, no, nothing can leak out of the material so that you keep your ice, your cold water, everything that's in here nice and well, safe, I guess. This thing is really, really strong, if I'm being totally honest with you. Like, it'd be hard to put a hole in this or anything. Even if you do put a hole in it, you do get a warranty on it. I'm not sure how long it is, but it does come included inside when you purchase this product. So, I'm gonna, t I'm gonna be totally honest with you. The shape, as you guys can tell, it is a square, and it, it weighs quite a lot. This thing is quite heavy for the size of it. Obviously, with it having such a hard shelled outer with the plastic being so thick and so strong with such an insulated inside to keep your ice nice and cold, it's going to be heavy. It's going to weigh a lot. But I think Domegic have really done something really weird here, especially with this with the shape of it. Most Eskies you'd see for the 22 Liga, it'd be more rectangular, a bit more deeper. But Domegic have seemed to have made it a full like square shaped box which for me, being a fisherman who rides their bike down to the beach and stuff like that, I found this more or less impossible to bring down to the beach if I'm riding my bike. With my gear, my rods, my backpack, everything loaded up, this is really a struggle when it's full of ice and food and water to get onto your bike and to bring it down to the, down to the beach, even if it's five minutes away. It's really, it's, it's quite hard. Um, the weight especially, the weight is something I was not expecting with this. Most Eskies probably weigh less than this thing. Probably about the same weight actually. When I've got it loaded up with the ice and stuff, some Eskies probably weigh the same as this does when this is empty. So, the Mega could really... I, I know that the Mega could made these so that they last, they've got the ice, it keeps it cool, but it's it's too much weight i was struggling to carry this when it was full a couple of days ago i went down to not my local beach but another beach and i was walking around trying to find the track onto the beach and this thing's a struggle to carry um that's enough with me actually the strap is another con that i have against this bag 
clearly is not a long strap. You guys can see it. Oh, it's not long. That's that's as long as it goes. Now this is one of seven sizes in the Domegic range, I believe, for their cooler boxes. Any size up from the twenty-two liter one does come with the added handles on each side. Obviously, this does not have it because it's too small, but. I think it'd be a lot easier if those handles were included on every single size box so that you can carry it a lot easier. This strap, honestly, it, it feels like a strong strap, but it's obviously too short. It's really, it's just, it's a struggle to carry this thing in itself, obviously because it's so bulky, it's such a big size cooler and the strap is just too small. But that's enough of me bagging it saying that's, that's all the cons done. Let's go into the rest of it. So as you guys can tell, two latch opens. Flip them both up. You gain access to your um, cooler box. As you can see, the plastic continues on the inside. As you can see, nice big room here. The lid of the box is actually um, um, outlined with foam. This is to not only prevent the box from possibly hitting itself and breaking when it closes, it also keeps the insulation in there, makes keeps all your drinks and stuff nice and cool. Now I have to admit this this is a nice size. I like the size of this Esky. As I've said, I don't like how they've produced the size of the Esky, but I think this is a good size for every fisher. Whether or not um, whether or not you're going day fishing or um, maybe just going down for a couple hours or going river fishing, beach fishing. Even taking this out on the boat is great to store your food in, ice, maybe some food if you want, your bait, and of course, if you catch any fish which need to be put on ice and you don't have anywhere else, this thing is great for it. There is a lot of space in here, and I think that the space especially, it's suitable for everyone, no matter, no matter the circumstances. I think that maybe if you were per like personally, there is a smaller option, the 13 litre one, but that one was like $100 and I wasn't gonna spend that much money on it. But that could possibly be better for someone like me who rides their bike, who maybe walks down to the beach and who, who like just likes doing stuff like that, who doesn't necessarily have a car or wants to take their car, but still wants to have like cold water or cold drinks and cold food and stuff like that down on their fishing trips. Now, with these, with the Domegic range, they've really done really well to customize the accessibility and what you can do with these Eskies. Um, with any size up from the 22 litre model, there is actually an opening in the mount, like in the opening of the Esky. And that is actually so that you can put accessories in, I believe they sell fishing rod holders, cup holders i think you might even be out by a table in which it just clips in here clips onto your esky so it's great you can really do a lot of things with these eskies i think Domega could have done a brilliant job of making these an all-round great esky um as i've already said there is there are some cons that i don't like but you guys might like that you guys might not have a problem with that if you i say as if you've got a car you can easily drive this down to the beach and you've got no worries. But I think this is a great product, as you can see. Flip it onto the bottom, it come, it's got four feet on there. Now those feet are obviously gonna stop that from uh, hitting the very bottom, possibly breaking a hole in your esky or anything. But if that does happen, when you purchase this product, it does come with a warranty. Sign up, send that into Domegic, or just keep your receipt with the warranty sticker on it. Comes in the box and you'll be good to go for however long the warranty lasts. Now, do I recommend this product? Of course I recommend it. And whether you're a boat fisher, beach fisher, river fisher, any, any fisher, Domegic have really catered all of their sized eskies and ice boxes to fit what people need. For example, boats, they've got massive 200 legal ones for those big days out deep sea fishing, catching those massive wahoo and stuff like that. They've got smaller eskies like this one, the 13 litre one. They've just got everything. These are great for taking down to the park, maybe if you're not actually even a fisher. 
you can take these down to the park for a family meetup or something. They're really, they're really good. They keep your eye, they keep your food and drink cold. What I tend to do, just because of how much it already weighs, I'll just cover the floor of the esky in ice. That seems to be enough to get me through a day, possibly more, out in the Australian heat. And as you guys probably know, we're getting 30, mid 30s, high, high, low 40s over in Australia. So I think the Mega have really made this good to be insulated. Um, it's a very solid esky. It's not going to break if it does break. As I've already said, you've got warranty on it. It's very unlikely that it's going to break. It is, it's got quite a rough plastic material on it. And I think it's just an all-round pretty good esky. Despite the shape, I know that the 13-litre one is a bit narrower. It's more of a rectangular shape, which I think is perfect for people, as I've said, that ride their bikes to fishing locations or anything like that. But if you guys are wondering, yes, I 100% recommend getting this product. Just look into all the different sizes before you do buy this and find the one that suits you best. Like, as I've already said, different sizes for different scenarios, boat fishing, river fishing, but beach fishing, anything like that, the Mega have got a sized esky for you. Obviously, if you can afford it, look into those accessories that come with it as well because those, I think those are really cool because I have never seen an, um, a cooler box brand do that before. And I think the Mega have done a really good job with making this very family friendly to use. And it's very, it's a nice looking esky. I like the, it's like a whitey color. Matched with the black stickers, obviously. So yes, I 100% recommend getting this product. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Drop, down, drop a comment down below if you guys are thinking about copying one of these and what size you might be copying it for and what you actually are planning to do with this esky. I would love to see what you guys have planned to use these things for. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe, leave a like. As I said, comment down below and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.